Buddy in Africa is not a good cartoon. This is a Warner Brothers cartoon from 1935. It's directed by Ben Hardaway and written by George Manuel, with a voice cast including Jackie Morrow and the four Blackbirds. And it is, of course, a Buddy cartoon. And Buddy has this variety store that he travels with, and he has apparently travelled to Africa with it. And... He pulls up the, the store in his little van or truck or whatever it is and opens up the shop. And that was quite fun to see the different things he was selling. That bit was quite interesting. I was keen to see him interacting with more of his supplies because it is a, quite a big variety. And unfortunately, they didn't really bother to do that. We got a little bit of it, sure, but it's almost like it took a back seat in the narrative. What they decided to focus on was the racial stereotyping of the characters, the African characters, the African people, they are so badly done. The stereotypes are insane. And pretty much all we get for the majority of the cartoon, occasionally it remembers to cut back to Buddy, but mostly we're just looking at these stereotypes, these caricatures, and they're just dancing or moving around or just doing nothing for the most part. Occasionally they'll interact with something that Buddy has and that in itself is really awkward because they're treating the objects that Buddy has as if they're the weirdest things ever and they don't know how to react to it and they don't know how to respond to it. And we're getting this sense of a severe lack of intelligence, which is obviously not something the cartoon should be doing at all. For example, there was one character who put bulbs in his ears. There was one who put candles in his mouth. And I'm, I'm not 100% trying to say these characters don't even know what to do with these or if they're trying to say these characters are so stupid this is what they do with their free time and they just mess around with things either way it's it's not a great way to depict characters like this and it's just appalling in the animation of the african characters absolutely horrendous some of the worst that i've ever seen certainly from warner brothers at this time and it's just really awkward and they clearly created this to try and get some and I put this in air quotes comedy out of these caricatures because that's basically all the cartoon has to offer there's not much else going on occasionally we'll get some animals um that that's fine the backgrounds are, are quite, quite well animated I don't have any issues with that. Buddy is quite well animated. I like the outfit he's wearing. And as I said, I really liked to see inside of his variety store. I thought that could have been a, a really great thing to do uh, something fun with. Maybe not in this setting, but as a concept, it could have worked quite well if they'd taken a different angle. But unfortunately, they didn't. And it's not good. Buddy in Africa is, without a doubt, a pretty terrible cartoon.